Hey, what's up everybody? Nick and Matt here with Swap today to give you another shoe review. Today we're out here at Waterworld. For absolutely no particular reason, <laughs> we just didn't feel like filming in the apartment this go around, so here we are. Today we're taking a look at the new Jordan 1 UNC to Chicago. There's a security camera, they're watching us. Yeah. They get the first look. But we'll get through it. We're gonna be okay. All right, guys, so before we dive into the shoe, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, both at SwappedCo. Share this video with everyone, comment, and let us know what you think. And if you do happen to be watching this on YouTube, please, 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 please be sure to subscribe to the channel. Uh, give it a big thumbs up and leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. Ring the bell. And get a little, uh, ring the bell. Get a little dialogue going ring in, the bell. in the comment section. Ring the bell. Yeah, ring the bell. Ding! All right, guys, so jumping right into the shoe here, we have the Jordan 1 UNC to Chicago. And for those of you that know, this is like the second rendition of the shoe. There was a patent leather version that dropped for men. This shoe is a woman's exclusive shoe, mm -hmm. um, but it goes all the way up to like a size 13 women or something like that. So for all you big footers out there that want this shoe, sorry. It's for me. It's for the little footer. It's for little guys. Little guys like me. Uh, but diving into the shoe, it's a red North Carolina, not really even North Carolina blue, it's like a powder blue. Uh, but the leather quality is fire. Yeah, and the first thing that I noticed when we pulled these out of the box was how soft the leather was. Um, the quality on them definitely seems like an 11 out of 10 for sure. Um, and yeah, in my opinion, he mentioned the the UNC in a Chicago colorway that dropped in the Fearless pack. Yeah, the Fearless, yeah. And we have a video uh, on currently, and that, rendition of the shoe is a uh, patent leather um, all the way around and it's kind of like the inverse of this as well um, yeah. and in my opinion this tumble leather shoe is a mu much better looking shoe uh, I'm not a huge fan of the patent leather a lot of times in a sneaker so this one in my opinion definitely does a trick for me uh, and I'm a big fan of the way the shoe came out for sure yeah I'm def I'm more of a fan of the patent leather version yeah this version is cool too though but to me if, I, if you already have the top threes you don't need the shoe mm -hmm. So if, if you have the top threes and you still want the shoe, by all means, get it. But if you have mm -hmm. it, I'm telling you right now, you don't need the shoe. Mm -hmm. And to go over to some of the details of this shoe, yeah, like we mentioned already, it has a really like premium leather, mm -hmm. soft to the touch. And you also have this leather red hang tag with Nike Air embossed. And this is an early look too. So if you're planning on getting a pair of these, mm -hmm. just so just to touch on some a few things that will let you know they're legit, yeah it's like oh yeah for sure under the shoe tag like the back of the tongue under this part right here this little tab you should have some like serial numbers right there yeah so that's a good thing to always check and then you also want to check your insoles one insole's red in the right shoe the left insole's left, the UNC. left insole's blue yeah so this is your insole there's not a lot to it it's it's like light glue strips so if you take out the insole whatever pair you get just make sure it looks like this, you know? I mean, that's pretty much it. Yeah. I mean, that's I, the most important thing is that serial number under the tag because the Foo Foo factories, as they call them, are not going to, they're probably not going to get that. Yeah, it's those little subtleties that'll really help you in establishing whether or not the shoe is a fake or real. Uh, but yeah, other than that, I mean, you guys know what the shoe looks like. You've or seen take photos it to your local. It. Yeah, true. They'll help you out. Like, I took sure. it to um, our local, which is Prestige. Mm hmm to get it legit checked and they were able to do that. So that was cool. That's out of, out of 10, what do you think? Out of 10, I'm gonna give these like a, a solid eight out of 10. Mm -hmm. And the only reason I'm getting it, giving it an eight out of 10 is because the quality of the shoe, the concept of the shoe is cool. Mm -hmm. I just don't think it was a necessary shoe. Sure. Which is why it's not getting that, those two extras to make it a full dime. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, that makes sense. But uh, yeah. other than that, fire shoe yeah that's the shoe guys that's it all right guys thank you so much for watching this video matt and i truly appreciate everyone definitely do. who stops by the channel subscribes likes it mm -hmm. um you know it shows all the love we appreciate mm -hmm. everybody 
And if you're on Twitter, Instagram, make sure you're following us at Swapco. Yeah. And share this with everyone. Let us yeah. let them know what we got going on. Yeah, for sure do that. For sure listen to this guy. Definitely and if listen you to me. Are watching this on YouTube? Yeah. Please, please, please remember to subscribe to the channel. Subscribe. We're putting out a ton of videos all the time. So if you want to stay tuned with what we're up to, definitely yeah. hit the subscribe button. And then smash the like button as well. Leave us a comment and ring the notification bell as well. Ring it. Uh, yeah. And that oh. way that way you'll be notified right off the bat when we post one of our most recent videos. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next video. Okay, so... We gotta, we gotta like do our walk-off thing. No, but we can't do the walk-off thing because you're trapped right here. I know, but I'm gonna... If look, I, look, if I, look, look, look. <laughs> look what he has to do. I know. All right, y'all. Should we go down the slide? Well, I mean, just come up. Yeah, there you go, and then just come up. You know what? Let's leave these here for the next, the first person that comes.